Toronto? Yeah, I'm down from Toronto. All right, everyone, we're just about to hop into our Model Y test ride. So I thought I would uh, give you guys a live experience of what it's all about. I'm going to be two fisted on this one because I got to get my other camera going here. So as I said before in the uh, live stream earlier when you got a chance to see the Model Y, it is literally a Model 3 just uh, increased in dimensions. Um, it looks very much, I mean, if you saw the car on the street, you would probably confuse it for a Model 3. Actually, they have a, uh, well, you can't see it here, but there's an aerodynamic uh, test buck that they used for testing. Uh, but they have one running car tonight. It is the blue one you might have seen in the live stream. So I think it's actually coming around the corner here. The ride will be very short because they're just going down to the end of the street, turn around, coming back. But yeah, here it is. Oh, the next one. Okay. Here is the Model Y. And it looks like, is that the same blue that you guys are offering now? Uh, yeah. Okay. So we'll be actually in the next ride. So it'll be another couple of minutes. Hang in. This is the Model Y, everyone. It is uh, a larger Model 3. We're just waiting for our test ride. It'll be a couple more minutes, so just hang in there. I know it's late here for us too. I'm still operating on East Coast time. Aha. So you behind us here, it says uh, S3, X and Y, sexy. They need the R on the end though for sexier, I think. So my compatriots in our test ride is uh, James Locke. We got Kim Paquette. I didn't catch your name. Eric. Eric, yes, Eric is coming with us. Oh, very good. This is not your first ride in the exit. Uh, he won't say. <laughs> lots of people. We got lots of people here in line. So our ride will be here momentarily. What do I think about the Model Y? Do you think it's overhyped? Um, no, I don't think so. It's exactly what we expected. Uh, and it's going to sell like gangbusters because North America loves small SUVs. So this is uh, the right product for that market. Don't change anything. They got a good recipe on the Model 3. Just make it a little bigger to accommodate this market and we're good to go. Okay, here's our test ride. Just wait just a second. Yeah, they've got their own little thing they've got going on. So I'm going to get a chance to sit in the front seat and you'll get a view out the front and get a good chance to look at the windshield. All right, thank you very much. Excuse me. All right, just going to put down the camera, take my bag off if that's okay. Hello. Hello. How are you? Hi. Good evening. Very well, thank you. Yes, yeah, so here's the windshield. You're not going to see too much here, but it's uh, definitely a little further back. We've got a great big panoramic glass roof, and it looks just like the glass roof you'd find on a Model S these days. Wow. Um, get a good shot. Kim, if you could get a shot of the back seat for me, the jump seat, so we get an idea of how big it is. You got it. All right. But uh, yes, the center console is basically just like a Model 3. They've reused parts, and it works. Uh, it is. Oh, I'm sorry. You say it's going to bang us. This is a crazy glass roof. There we go. Okay, we're all set. It looks bigger. Same performance. Yes. Yeah. 
uh, are you able to tell us whether this is a dual motor car? <laughs> no answer. No, no answer. answer. This is. No comment. Okay. Yeah. Engineering validation <laughs> prototype. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's the same low center of gravity as the Model 3, so a really great handling. Nice. Okay. Nice. It's smooth. It Very nice. Smooth. It's just like the 3, honestly. It, oh, yeah. It just feels the... just like it. Yeah. Three would benefit. And, yes. Uh, yes. All oh, that leg room back here. And actually. you can't yeah, tell yeah, here on the video, yeah. folks, but this does have an Alcantara headliner. Yeah, it does. For now. For now. For now. We'll see what happens. Oh, look at that. Okay, good. This is awesome. Yeah. This is this is a nice car. Yes. You got lots of headroom I back there. It looks like. Oh, tons of headroom. I'm, yeah. I'm six foot one. I'm yeah. sitting very high back here. Yep. You look at your headroom. Yeah. yeah. It's like yeah. So you'll see that the dome yeah. lights are in six the uh, side yeah. pillars. Yeah. Like, yeah. This and is I'm very nice. Six. Oh, there I hit my head there. But <laughs> <laughs> well, you're you're what six four? No, six no? one. Six one. Oh, okay, sorry. But on six one seats, in the back seat, yeah. comfortable. Is... Can you please slide out on the left, left side? side? You okay, got we're going to hop out here. Thank you, for the lift. Thank you very much. Enjoy your evening. Thank you. i got to grab my bag, too. Thank you for the ride. All right, folks, just give me a second here. We're going to get organized. Thanks for riding, sir. Thank you very much. Very nice. All right, you can see here door pockets in the Model Y. Should I go around the other side? And there you go. That's the ride. We'll have more about it, say it later, once we get more technical details. Okay, we're just going to... Okay, hold on here. Let's let's get everybody live to see this. All right, so you saw... The side pillars. Um, I'm assuming they fold down. Okay. Okay, so you're able to see a little bit of the storage space in the back. So it's not too bad. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I could see when I was turning around that the, the back seat looked really nice. With that glass roof, yeah, I think they got a good winner there. Yeah. No, they nailed it. Looks good. All right, thanks for your opinions, guys. Shout out to Kim and James. Follow them on Twitter. All right, thanks, guys. All right, we're going to sign off. Uh, apologies for that. There we go. So we're going to uh, sign off here on the live stream. You'll be able to watch anytime you want. And uh, I've got lots of video. I have to edit some stuff so you'll be able to see a little bit more what we're talking about. So far, I think they got a winner in their hands. Put your reservation down. It's 2500 bucks, fully refundable. Uh, production starts in late 2020. So we'll, uh, we'll keep an eye on this. Don't forget, go to the Model 3 Owners Club forum slash Model Y because we're covering that car right now. We have forums already set up for the Model Y. So you guys can go in there and start talking about the car. Anyways, thanks for watching. We'll see you soon. Bye.